Hey my love, it's your girl Mary J. Welcome back to yet another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I apply my Aztec Clay Max. Starting off, I'm going to be showing you guys the things that you're going to need. That is a mixing bowl, a brush to mix with, and of course the clay itself, and apple cider vinegar. And if you don't have apple cider vinegar, water works just fine. Sometimes I use water and it works the same way. So either one is fine. First, you pour the clay inside of the mixing bowl, of course. Next, I am going to pour some vinegar inside of the mixing bowl with the clay. Um, you want to eyeball it so therefore it's a good consistency. So pour as little or as uh, much vinegar as needed for the clay to have a smooth consistency. So I am just going to keep on stirring until I get the consistency that I'm looking for. I like my consistency to be nice and thick, so but really still smooth. You want the, um, the mixture to be smooth and that's the important part. Um, like I mentioned in my last video, I try to do this three times a week. If you haven't seen my last video, my skincare routine, I will go ahead and link that on the cards above. And down at the description bar for you guys so definitely check that out um, but yeah I try to um, keep up with my clay mask about three times a week but you know um, now I am just applying the clay mixture all over my face nice and even I don't miss a spot I put it all over my face um, definitely love the clay mask i think that it helps me with my breakout i do get breakout guys so when i do realize that you know i am breaking out i definitely you know would do a mask and i would immediately almost see a difference like Um, this clay is also good for your hair. I haven't personally tried it on my hair yet But I have seen people try it on their hair and I have heard good results. So Definitely a good buy if you can use it on your hair and on your skin. So win-win So after I have applied everything on my face and don't worry, I'm just being my regular weird self <laughs> but um you want to let the clay dry when you start to see a crack that's when you know that it is completely dry and it is ready to wash off so my max is completely dried now i am going to wash it off if it's one thing that i don't like about this process it's the washing off part i mean this stuff takes a minute for you to completely wash it off your face like you gotta really tackle this thing off your face <laughs> Um, rubbing your face in a circular motion definitely helps um, break down the clay and you know removes it off your face a little quicker which is something that I have learned 
after the struggle but got it down packed but yeah definitely want to make sure you wash the whole thing off your face make sure that your face is nice and clean Right after I have finished washing everything off my face, like so, my skin is looking nice and fresh. Um, I will go ahead and apply a toner, same way like I did in my skincare routine. Again, link in the description bar, go check it out. And that's it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching to the end. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.